Hello, YouTube pipe smoking community. Just wanted to say hi to some of the most beautiful and amazing people on the planet. Of course, I'm talking about us pipe smokers. Here in Kansas City, things are really starting to cool off. And that means I start smoking a lot of Burleys. I go from Virginia and Periques. Virginia is more to Burley type blends and heartier Englishes. And right now I'm smoking one of my favorite all time blends, Solani. What is that? Hang on. I got everything in a box behind me. I'm at the park with my dog. 660 blend silver flake it's basically virginia with some spicy dark fire kentucky is how they build it and i think it's one of the most brilliant uses of dark fire kentucky ever it's not overwhelming you know sometimes dark fired especially to an inexperienced pipe smoker can be a bit overwhelming you know it's got a lot of nicotine a lot of punch you know this is just burning fantastic and it's looks like a nice sunny day but it's really still cold here or cool I should say it's not exactly cold anyways I got a couple other things I want to show you out of my haversack of pipe smoking utopia my Peterson pipe pouch always goes with me whenever I'm on the road just the best pipe pouch ever for me. It holds two pipes, a little bit of tobacco. Uh, best pipe tool ever, the simple Rogers pipe tool. It can ream, it can, it can do everything. It's just wonderful. The only thing bad about it, it's got a little bit of a small footprint on the tamper. But anyway, back to bigger and better things. Ye. Ha, Merry Christmas, me. Hey there, Frodo. You wanna say hi? Oh, there's the old dog. I lost mutt. Beautiful presentation by Peterson, usual. I love Peterson, Salvinelli, you know. Like most pipe smokers, I like their low end $100 pipes or great yeah now i've already seen this smoked a half a bowl i got the other day and i couldn't resist the weather was crap i didn't want to go out and shoot a video but anyways i think see if i can get this in some good light yeah i really like that it's got this ready shoe i don't know how much that's coming through real nice Sandblast. I worried about getting a you know white stem. I don't know why. I mean, it shouldn't really stain or anything different than the black one. But anyways, real excited about that. I really like that pipe. Next, I need to get a Peterson Bulldog. Anyways, this couldn't help me not to show someone, right? I mean, just like most people, I don't have many pipe smoking friends. I have a couple buddies that, you know, if I show up with some pipe tobacco, they'll smoke some with me every once in a while. But, you know, they're casual pipe smokers at best. Usually smoke aromatics. Here with this Peterson, I, uh... Wanted to try this, 1865. I really enjoyed this. This is just a straight up English, no scent or topping or over topping, I should say. It's not it's just got a good clean tobacco smell. I really am enjoying this. It's not a lot bomb, but it's got enough. I mean, it's not a light. I don't know if you can see any of this. There we go, looks like some light. You see it's got some black and light speckles just real good english not over complicated just real good tobacco i really enjoyed it's a bit pricey kind of at a high price point but figured to 10 i got to try it at least one time. so there's my peterson 2017 christmas pipe wonderful really love it so far 
and uh, the Peterson 1865. I hope I'm not rattling this around too much at this point. I'm sorry, people. I'm so awkward. Wow. It just totally flipped. You can see my studio setup is second to none. Ooh, there we go. See, everything got flipped. This is the uh, Savinelli uh, cleaning kit. And as I get it out, um, I'll put it back in. I uh, opened it up. I did an inventory, made sure everything was in there. But this is real handy. It kind of came with everything you need. A real good startup cleaning kit. I got it at smokingpipes.com. Oh, Lord. Okay. I think I got everything under control from this point forward. Comes with this, you know, real handsome tin. It's got a thing so you can set your pipes on it. I usually, I'm not, a, a, I never buy a Dunhill or whatever fancy brand $500 pipe. I'm gonna mess it up. I'm, I'm not that tidy with it. I get crap around my rim. Uh, but I do like to keep them somewhat clean and I usually use olive oil on my stem and I got a I forgot what brand I got a a paste you put on and it kind of waxes it and cleans it this is a few year old now Savinelli uh, St. Nicholas um, but like as you can see I mean I get stuff on the top I don't you know, some people, I mean, if, you, if you're a real pipe guy and care about that, you know, it makes a big deal. I won't spend a lot of money on a pipe. I abuse them. I drop them. I use them. Uh, I don't care, but I do try to keep them generally hygienic, clean, and, you know, no nastiness on the stem. Came with a couple of these. Uh, one's an applicator pad. I think that's uh, two wipe-offs and one applicator uh, is in there I'm trying to do this as gentle as possible I am so sorry people I didn't intend on that box to come open like that if anyone's watching and paying attention which I doubt I'm more of a watcher than I am you know, I'm not good at videos. I don't feel comfortable. I don't feel natural. I have a tendency to scratch my face, say y'all. Just nerves. This is the uh, pipe cleaner. Yay. I think that's the one for the bowl. And then you got a, it comes with a reamer and it looks to be a relatively decent reamer. handful of uh, little pipes cleaners uh, inventory list a little bit of foam and then here's the uh, stem polish and this is the actual pipe polish for the outside of the bowl on the briar and like I said, uh, you can see it comes with everything you, you really need to clean, clean your pipes. Excuse me, I'm a barbarian. Uh, so, yeah, I wanted to share that kit with you. I got it at uh, smokingpipes.com. I love smoking pipes. They do a wonderful job of packaging and uh, make sure your shipment's correct. I never had any issues with them. I'll show you this tin again. It's rather handsome. Could signal if I get lost. Help me. Um, but yeah, this is a 140 year anniversary cleaning kit. I got that just a kind of novelty as much as anything. I love tins and things like that. And I uh, wanted to give it uh, props on the Peterson uh, 2017 Christmas Edition pipe. It's been wonderful so far. Solani Silver Flake. If it's getting cool and you like uh, a little bit of dark fire, they ain't going to knock you over, but got a great, great taste. Um, 
try not to get too much into uh, spoiler details of what you're going to get. That's for you to discover. But I'm telling you, this is really a good tobacco for me. One of my favorites. It's a bit pricey, but, you know, I don't smoke it every day, obviously. So I think that's all I have to say on these topics. And I'm going to sign off. I hope you guys have a good fall and going into the holiday season. I hope everybody has safe travels. If you travel and see your family, loved ones, friends, be careful. And I will see you guys later. Take care.